The makers of Don't Starve Clay Entertainment has partnered up with their friends at Cappy to bring us an awesome new single player DLC expansion called Don't Starve Shipwrecked. It lets all of us who are curious about the water's edge venture out and explore the sea with new playable biomes, characters, creatures, and seasonal effects. Wilson and the entire Don't Starve cast will embark on a seabound journey of exploration, adaptation, and of course, starvation. You start off on an island. Where else? And immediately you will be able to tell that the entire environment is completely different. There's new tropical biomes that have coconut trees, coral reefs, and water all around you. In order to survive being shipwrecked, you have to be able to build a boat to travel between the different islands. There are several different tiers of boats that you can build, ranging from a small bamboo raft all the way up to an armored boat. And there's even different attachments that you can attach to your boat such as a cannon, sails, nets, and a lantern. But I still don't recommend going out sailing in the dark because that's, that's certain death. <laughs> Along your travels, you will also see new creatures such as monkeys, poisonous snakes, jellyfish, <laughs> and much, much, much more. Like a lot more. Look at this list. This DLC has added so much really cool nautical stuff, but the new creatures also bring new dangers. If you get too close to the jellyfish, they'll shock you. And the poisonous snakes, of course, are going to poison you if they bite you. The good thing about the poisonous snakes, though, is that you can make different things, such as poisonous darts or spears or any poisonous things from their venom, which can help you kill your enemies much more efficiently. Speaking of killing, new weapons such as the spear gun, which has a powerful single use, poisonous darts and spears, harpoons, and the coconade. A grenade made from a coconut used to obliterate enemies or monkeys. The weather is also going to be a huge new factor while living on the island. And emphasis on wetness, or actually staying dry, is going to be a must for any survivor. Volatile new weather elements such as torrential winds that blow things around, monsoons, hailstorms that drop ice chunks, and the wet and the dry seasons have become a survival threat. If you are out in the sea during just the regular winds, you will be fine though, because winds can actually benefit you as you sail. If you fly with the wind, you will speed across the water, but if you sail against the wind, then you can find obviously it takes far longer to get anywhere. And boats have durability, so if your boat breaks while you're in the deep sea, I'm guessing things aren't gonna be too good for you. <laughs> A few last cool things to mention are electric isosceles, Illuminati confirmed. Instead of the wormholes, these electric isosceles can teleport you around the map. They are Bermuda Triangles. Other things that you can see are messages in a bottle, which will lead you to an X on the map with treasure. And pier glasses, which, like, I forget the real word for it. It's not a telescope, is it? But the thing pirates use, it's a pier glass. It'll actually let you see on the map in the direction you're going for a short distance, but it helps clear the map and lets you see if, so you don't have to sail in the wrong direction. As you saw on the list I showed earlier, there is tons of new stuff to craft, explore, and run from. So I'm totally sure that this expansion is going to live up to Don't Starve and the Reign of Giants previous expansion and game. And it'll probably be another thing that I lose myself to for hours on end. <laughs> and it's only five bucks. You can't really beat it. It's not bad. If you all enjoyed this video today, please hit that like button. It means a lot to me and to Wilson. Leave a comment down below letting me know of any new or old games that you would like me to talk about. And if you'd like to see more of me, you can find me on my channel, Brits Games. All of my links are always down below in the description. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next week. Goodbye. Oh my God, it's Harry Potter. Chess, let's Harry play. Harry Potter? Oh, I see the scary person. Okay. Uh, Where are you? Uh, nowhere. You didn't see me, I promise. I Hi did it, God. you're right. I know, that's why I'm running away like, Oh, I'm not going to be able to do this. I, I'm a terrible I'm scared. I'm scared. Impulse is produced by the Freedom Network.
ever wanted to earn revenue from your videos? Freedom offers a great partnership program which includes access to hundreds of thousands of audio tracks, sponsorships with great partners, and most importantly, a no lock-in contract. You can leave at any time for any reason. We accept everyone, both big and small. For more information, click here or visit the link in the video description.